Hello everyone, welcome to Fanatical Finance, and we'll be talking about the basic ideas of finance today. The four topics we're going to cover are income and expenses, assets, debt and equity, and income and risk. What is income? Income is when an amount of money comes to you. The three main sources of income are working labor, which is your everyday job, selling capital, which is investing, and renting capital, which is owning your property. What are expenses? Expenses are when you pay money for services such as mortgages, loans, and insurance. Surplus versus deficit. If your income is greater than your expenses, you have a budget surplus. However, if your income is lower than your expenses, you have a budget deficit. You should always want to be in the budget surplus zone. What are assets? Assets are resources that you own. Two common assets are stocks and your own house. Your stocks increase your income, while your house reduces expenses for the long term. What is equity? Equity represents ownership. You can also split equity with other people. For example, let's say the previous owner of the Boston Celtics wants to sell the team for a billion dollars. One investor is going to put in $750 million, the second investor is going to put in $200 million, and the third investor is going to put in $50 million. The first investor will own 75% of the team, the second will own 20%, and of course, the third will own 5% of the team. What is debt? Debt is running or borrowing money from someone else over time. The two most common types of debt are credit card debt and student loan debt. Risk to your income. Possible labor risks include economic downturns, poor performance, global crisis like the one we're in right now, accidents. A solution is another side job. Possible investment risks include bad investment choices. A solution is diversifying your portfolio. Also, do not put all your money into investing. Thanks for watching my first video. Please consider liking and subscribing as it helps with the YouTube algorithm. Comment down any future video suggestions. Once again, thanks for watching.